Okay, so we're going to talk about how to throw a hook ball, how to throw a hook, uh, spin the ball. There's many, many terms, but what we're trying to do here is to create uh, right to left motion down the lane because we're trying to knock down 10 pins. And what we're, what we're doing when we're going to throw a, a hook ball is we're going to create some room for error so that we don't have to strike the head pin in the perfect spot to, uh, to uh, throw a strike. And, you know, this is one of the favorite subjects for the beginner because when they walk into the bowling center, they see a lot of people throw this really neat from right to left if you're right-handed um, hook. So we're going to talk about how to do that. Now, the hook really happens here at the release point, and, and what we're trying to do is to get our hand to rotate, okay, uh, counterclockwise just at the point of release. And a lot of it has to do with your, your body position, but really you want the, your head to be right over the ball or slightly on the outside of the ball, and your hand to be coming from the back of the ball. And your hand's going to probably rotate ab about a half a turn. We're not going to fly our elbow. We're not going to twist our arm. It's really all about setting the, setting the ball in your hand and creating a shelf and having the hand go from slightly cupped, as we call or slightly cocked, to uncocked, and we're going to give the ball to the lane, meaning the hand, the elbow, is going to collapse at the bottom, and you're going to create not only RPMs, but you're also going to create side rotation, okay? And what that means is we're going to create a rotation in a different direction that the ball is traveling. So again, that's the way to do it. We want our elbow on the inside, we want our head on the outside of the ball, and everything happens right here, right by the ankle, okay? So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to grab a bowling ball and I'm going to show you in live time. And what we've done with the ball also is we put a piece of white tape on it so you can actually see the rotation of the ball and you can see the counterclockwise rotation. And we'll give you a couple different angles so that you can see what we're talking about.